Hi guys, welcome to my kitchen because it's a lot harder to film in my bathroom than it is to film in my kitchen. I wanted to talk to you guys about our body care today. Now while I don't have everything on display here, I have quite a few products and if you've been watching my posts, you probably have noticed them going up and they'll continue to go up throughout the day. I know we talk Mary Kay makeup, we talk Mary Kay skincare, and a lot of people kind of realize after the fact that we actually have a lot of stuff to cover you from the neck down. And that's one of the reasons why I wanted to share with you guys because, well, I don't know, I just guess we don't talk about it as much, but it's definitely something we offer. And I think it's important to cover yourself from head to toe. So the first thing, the thing we're probably best known for is something called Satin Hands. You may have seen this before. It has an emollient to scrub and a lotion. And basically how it works is you first put the emollient on because if your hands are already wet, the stuff is like jelly and it slides right off. It's actually soy based, not uh, petroleum. And it's meant to emollient, it's an emollient. It's basically gonna hydrate your skin. After you wash it off, it continues to work penetrating layers deep, which is what really makes this a really great product. There's something similar called our extra emollient night gel that's meant for the face, but that can also be used everywhere. And I'll often use it if you run out of this first in a set, I'll give you that. This is, as you can see, mine. So the Satin Hand Scrub in the white tea and citrus. We also have an unscented or fragrance-free one. Once in a while, we'll come out with a seasonal scent, but this is the, currently the scented one we use. And it's meant to be a sugar scrub or sugar smoothie, as they like to call it, that you would use on your hands. You can technically use it on your feet too. And you might want to if you're trying to get like that callousy stuff off the back of your heels, what I call lizard skin. And then finally, once you rinse off with slightly warm water, the scrub and the emollient and pat dry, this is a shea infused hand lotion. So it's a little thicker than a regular lightweight lotion, but it's not so thick that like, you know, you can't manipulate it. And what I love about this, it lasts through about 15 hand washings. That's a lot. And if you have someone who's a nurse or a teacher or a mom, they wash their hands a lot. So this is a great gift by itself. Um, I do a lot of little Christmas stocking stuffers with this with gloves or scarves. I sometimes will do the masks with the scarves and you know keep this with the gloves and it's sister product that I absolutely love our mint bliss foot lotion not shea infused but also it has mint so if you don't like tingly feet don't use it but if you do or if you have someone who's diabetic and it's really important for them to keep their feet hydrated so that they don't develop cracks in their feet where infections can get in because remember the skin is one of the largest organs of your body and it's your first layer of defense against infection this is a great gift. I often will bundle this with a pair of really cute fuzzy socks. This is also what I use for my what you call adopt a grandparent program where people will purchase one of these to donate to a shut in in the town of Wellesley. That's right down the street from my church. And usually I partner with my church to package up and deliver them to the Wellesley friendly aid where they deliver to the shut ins these care baskets that include my gift among other things. And what I do is I just take my profit and match the purchase. So two of them are given away for the price of one set. And I can always post more about that in my VIP group. I won't be posting about it here, but I'm just letting you know that I do that and that I do like to do charitable giving when possible. Also along the same lines, we were talking about washing your hands. Well, you don't always need a sugar smoothie, but we do have our satin hands soap, which I like because it is basically the base without the sugar and it's fragrance free and great for washing your hands at the kitchen and bathroom sink and then of course you know we have the unscented version of that lotion the lotions can be sold separately while the set is sold together the soap is sold separately so oftentimes i'll find people buying the soap and lotion to give as a gift if you want to go one step further and add our new hand sanitizer now you've got the perfect trio it's not the same as the satin hand set maybe you get them both then they're all set. But this is a great little hostess gift. You put this with a roll of toilet paper. No, 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 I'll post a picture. It's called the Rona Bundle. All done up cute in a cello bag with a bow and maybe a bottle of wine or a gift card. That becomes a really nice gift to give to someone who's hosting Thanksgiving, Christmas, Hanukkah, Kwanzaa, whatever major holiday, New Year's Eve, you're going to in the next couple of months. I have this stuff in stock now so you don't have to worry about a shipping delay you don't have to worry about them saying oh we don't have that in stock sorry we can't help you no worries i've got tons of this stuff i planned ahead since summer to be sure i would have product on hand just so that wouldn't be an issue and you can say you're welcome you know thank you you're welcome anytime a sister to the satin hands is satin body we have something called body butter 
I leave this in my shower and you can see I actually use it. It's this whipped creamy, thicker lotion. Oh, it is just so soothing. And it's that same lightweight white tea and citrus scent. Sometimes people will add that on to a satin handset or a satin body product in a roll-up bag. It's sort of a spa gift. Now I've mentioned satin body a couple of times. There is a body wash, a body lotion, and a body scrub. And there's little stripes telling you one, two, three, so you can keep them straight when you're looking at them in the shower. Thank you for the like. I can't see who it is right now. I can't see comments. But oftentimes, you know, you can pair off these body wash and a lotion or just the two lotions. If you have someone who is recovering from radioactive ther radio radiation therapy or chemotherapy, cancer survivor, I myself am one, I know several who are. Being the month of breast cancer awareness, you might have seen my post about getting your mammogram. I had mine on Tuesday, but I posted today in my VIP group, but also just in general, I think it's important to do your monthly exam and also get your mammogram once a year, especially if you're in a high risk category, you're probably doing it more frequently. I am every year because I had cancer, so they don't want to take any chances. A big thing if you are recuperating from cancer therapy. So body lotions, face lotions, hydrating gel masks, eye patches. I think I give do a giveaway yesterday with a jade roller and a sample of the gel patches for the eye and a sample of the hydrating mask. That could be a very nice care pack with the full size product. I don't sell the jade roller, that's a gift, but I could I have some more so I can tuck that in with those two products if you wanted to purchase that to give to someone who's going through the recovery process. It is not a treatment. Uh, there, I can't make any promises. The label just says it hydrates your skin, but if that's one of the symptoms or side effects of those treatments, it can help soothe them. Along the same lines, if you like body products but you don't like scented, we have our standard Mary Kay body wash and lotion in this kind of pink and white label. My husband uses that in our shower. They don't really have body wash for the men. They do seasonally, but not every year. And it's scented like the colognes. He likes that, but not everyone likes the manly scents. And not everyone likes white tea and citrus. So he uses the unscented body wash and lotion in our shower. He doesn't care. It's pink. It's white on the back, so he's happy. And um, now we have new permanent line, not limited edition, berry and vanilla. And then I didn't remember to bring it up, apple and almond body wash and lotion. So if you like scents, these are a little more scented. It's only wash and lotion. There's no scrub. Um, there's no jar of extra thick lotion. But you, you can kind of mix and match a little if you don't mind smelling like a fruit basket. But this one, oh, it's like it's kind of springy, summery. And then the apple and almond, I consider that more of like a fall scent, which I'll be, when this is empty, I'll be switching to the other one. It's kind of a pink tube. You can look at it up on my website or my catalog. And um, I will list price points in the comments. I'm not going to try to do that now while talking. One of my other posts you might not have seen, but if you, it may have, it may have launched already. I think I posted it earlier today. And this is the older bottle. They just changed the cap to pink. Is our targeted action toning lotion. This is my secret. Um, well, now it's not a secret because I'm telling you about it. I use that on my wingspan here to kind of tighten it up and make it jiggle less. I'm not going to show you my leg. I use it on my thigh. I use it on my butt because I'm a pear-shaped girl. So there's a lot of me going on and there's a lot of lotion in this bottle. And what I love about it is it's really geared towards, um, it's a mix of botanicals, antioxidants formulated to help moisturize and redefine body contours by toning, firming, and smoothing your shape in one step. This is great for right after the shower. Or if you're not taking a shower, but you need to like put something on like a skirt or shorts and your legs are exposed, just pump real quick and put a little on your legs. Maybe you're changing into your jammies for bedtime. Perfect time to do it. And the other nice thing is, and this is a little trick I use in the winter months, while we do have a sunless tanner, some people don't like products that do stuff to your skin to change its color. But if you want a temporary color change, you can use this mixed with one of our CC creams, a shade darker than your skin tone, and smooth that on as a temporary tan. It'll give your legs a smoother look because of the lotion, and of course a slightly darker color does have that effect of making you look thinner. And it washes off at the end of the day, but like our CC cream is not designed to transfer onto your clothes as long as you're dry, you don't have to worry about it staining your clothing. So if you need a quick insta tan on your legs because it's winter and you've been wearing pants or a long skirt or you've been indoors but you need to look nice for a party or you're traveling and you're going somewhere else where you are going to get a suntan, 
there's no sunscreen in either of those products, although I must say the CC cream is SPF 15. It's not going to give you enough sun protection. You will, you will still tan. <laughs> if you are out in the sun in SPF 15, you will still tan, trust me, um, if you're anywhere tropical or fun. But if you want to at least show up not pasty white, that's a great little hack to use mixed with the CC cream and the toning lotion. So if you're going to put it on your legs anyways and you want to hit the color, it's a nice little thing to do. And it still does tone and smooth in the meantime. So that is a, a representative of our body care products. We do carry, as I said, sometimes, not always seasonal, men's body care, body wash usually. Um, there is not a men's body lotion because generally speaking, they use the unscented or they like the scented anyway. And um, I might have missed something, but for the most part, that is the, the bulk of our family of body care products. So I hope you enjoyed that little quick explanation. I was going to try to demo it, but I realized you can't even see my faucet. And if I make a mess... I'm going to have fun trying to clean that up before I prepare dinner, but I wanted you at least to kind of get that feel that here I'm at the kitchen sink where my soap is. And if I could have set up the camera in the bathroom, I might have been able to demonstrate better with the sink and a towel. Either way, I will put comments below afterwards with prices on the products. And if I think of something, I'll throw that in the comments and pay attention because I will be doing a giveaway tonight. And any giveaways I've already posted, like pick a pumpkin from the pumpkin patch or the uh, jade roller, I think the challenge was to create your own meme about masks and or um, I think hydration, like the under eye issues. I posted a couple of cute, funny pictures. So I want to see how creative and fun you can be. That way I can have everyone vote on the pictures they post and I will be the final judge and we'll pick a winner. I thought it'd be more fun than just randomly throwing prizes at people or having you guess the number of things in a jar because I've done that before and that gets old fast. Either way, um, oh and I still have the giveaway where if you use our scanning app, it's called Skin Analysis, and send me the picture, you will get a packet of samples customized based on the report it gave you. It's mailed to you courtesy of me so you can actually play with the product and you get a free consult with me, a walk through the samples so you know how to use them. And that's just a little office service I offer to all my customers and as a way for me to get to know you a little bit better. So look, look for the giveaways every day this week. And I will probably talk about a little assortment of things. I'm thinking I might cover fragrances on Friday as well as other products I might not have mentioned before. Kind of the unsung heroes of Mary Kay products. Saturday, I think my focus will simply be on wrapping things up. In case you're interested in hosting your own gathering virtually or in person, depending on where you're located. And um, the other thing is, I believe there is a special offer for Mary Kay consultants. If you're interested in checking out what I do and being a consultant and, and taking advantage of our discount and making money the way I do for the holiday season, you may want to consider it. And I'll tell you more about that on Saturday. And, oh, before I forget, I think I posted it here, but if I didn't, I may steal a giveaway from my VIP group and posted here today because it just dawned on me that'd be kind of fun. It's called, well, it was called Wishlist Wednesday, but we're just going to call it Wishlist Day. And I will post a wish list. If you download it or copy, screen copy it, screen grab it, fill it out and send it back to me, you will be entered into a drawing to win something off your win wish list, full size product. Also, you know, I will follow up with you to see how I can help you. Um, perhaps get your holiday shopping done. Hi, Cassandra, it's good to see you. And yes, I saw you picked a pumpkin from the patch. I'll be reaching out soon to you. I know, I didn't announce I was going live because I wasn't sure exactly what time I'd be on and I had to figure out how to set this camera up in front of my sink. So, you know, technology. But I'm glad to see you and I'm glad to see anyone else who popped on and gave me a thumbs up earlier. I'll have to go back later and see who that was. Thank you for watching. And uh, I'll be back live tomorrow, some prime probably in the afternoon. And as I said, go back and look at some of my previous videos and posts if you missed something. I posted about my color tutorials and my holiday gifting tutorials. You're welcome to go and check those out. If you need the link, just PM me. And if we're not already friends, feel free to friend me on Facebook. I will double check when I wrench and, you know, comment back. How did, how did you find out about me so I know? And Holly's still doing a giveaway this week. If you're shopping with any of the vendors, make sure... That, you know, they tell Holly so that you can get into her giveaway because I'd hate for you to miss out on free stuff because, girl, I'm a free stuff person myself. Have a good day.